that you just saw. A.J. Storr is in the paint, and he gets the first basket of the night. Hepburn out by the W, trying to make his way through. Crowl dips toward the basket. This is Storr for three, and A.J. Storr has five out of the gate for Wisconsin. 28% so far this year, but a three early tonight for Storr. Cardet bounces his way to the basket, left it short. Crowl had the rebound for a moment, taken away by Cameron Jernigan. This is Chicago State going into his zone. This is Wall breaking through the defense. Back quickly on the other end. Cardet kicks it out. Neal gives it right back. As Cardet tried to hit a cutting to Chandre Cole. It was knocked away by the Badger. A season ago, Gilmore with the bounce pass to Storr. Shot clock inside of five. Storr goes inside, puts it up, gets it to roll through, plus the foul. I think just look at the talent level. It's better, and they're getting more production from a variety of different people. They don't do this a lot. Wall runs the floor and lays it down. But that's what I mean by that first wave. Crowell trying to get loose. was kind of hooked by Green. He has the weak side pass to Storr. Another basket, another foul. And A.J. Storr will have a chance for another three-point play. Has scored 11 for the Badgers. A lot of their points have come to the free throw line. That pass or that shot was blocked by Wall. They get back in it against the Badgers. Store on the take. He's been outstanding here early on. He has 13 points. Some surprising wins under their belts this year so far. None more so than what they did in Evanston against the Wildcats. Crowell got loose on the give and go to the basket. All wins and they're trailing by nine here. Cutting to the basket, A.J. Storr was left alone. He dunks that, and he has a 17-point performance so far. Hepburn fights for it and secures it for Wisconsin. Storr got open again, a three, and it's good! A.J. Storr has 20! Leads to five points for Wisconsin, and now a takeaway. A.J. Storr on the fast break. One against one, Storr can't finish, and neither can Max Klesman on the second chance. Chicago State has only shot 30% from the field. Wisconsin has shot 50%. Hepburn bounce pass, whoa, with the layup. In the first couple of minutes of this half, Chicago State waited nearly 10 minutes in the first half. Hepburn picked a pocket, and then he got injured for Wisconsin. This is Blackwell as he lost the ball inside. Wall gets it back and goes off the glass. Not a very long leash for the Chicago yeah, yeah, State yeah, Cougars we, here. We've seen worse. Crowell goes up and scores over two defenders. Return for the next game. It's against Iowa on the second here in Madison. Crowell scored on the last possession and goes up with the left hand on this one. Gilmore kicks it out. This is McGee for three. Offensive rebound for Gilmore. Up and under. The basket plus the foul. Gilmore looking to make a move. Sends it out. Winter for three. Score with the putback dunk. I don't know if we wanted all that underneath the Christmas tree. John Charles, the three from the corner, misses. And Blackwell gets the rebound for Wisconsin. Only shot about 29% from the field in this game. Wall slipped under. Could have gone up with it. Instead, he lays it down to Klesman, who goes high off the window himself. He throughout this game. Made just three out of 15. Really, neither team has shot well from three. As Wall gets through around Corbin. I feel like he can really do a little bit of everything. Here's a three, and it's good. A.J. Storr continues his... Not just this year, pretty much every year, that's how it is here. Nice extra pass from Winter, feeding the cutting Klesmit to the basket. Final few minutes here, Wisconsin has been in control throughout this second half. Nice move by a Asijin, and it rolls through. Crowell has 13, and Tyler Wall 11. Sejan thought about putting it up, now he does. His three is good! A sharp shooter a year ago, Connor Sejan 